newly appointed SKNFA technical advisor Claude McAlealy arrived in St. Kitts Saturday afternoon and was received by a high-level delegation at the Kayanjet Lounge at the RB International Airport. McAlealy had an illustrious club career at Real Madrid and Chelsea. He arrived with his agent Sofiane Youssef, SKNFA President Atiba Harris, SKNFA First Vice President Sean White, Second Vice President Mr. Cuthbert Keynes, and the St. Kitts and Nevis Senior Men's National Team goalkeeper and captain Jelani Archibald. They were greeted by Prime Minister Dr. The Honorable Terence Drew, Sports Minister Samuel Duggins, SKNFA Technical Director Lenny Taylor, SKNFA General Secretary Tishel McLean, Senior Men's National Team Manager Jamiro Claxton, and National Team Coach Austin Huggins. After his arrival, McAlealy expressed his pleasure being in St. Kitts and playing the role as technical advisor. I think football is one of the sport put the newer generation in a good way, give them possibility for thinking different, care about the country, care about the, the community. I think it's very important in the way I accept this invitation. I know it's been footballer before. Yes. I know what I mean. Very thank you. I will do my best. Yes. For give you all the answers I know, because in this way is my specialty. The way you are a minister, <laughs> the way you are president for the federation, uh, him president for the football in this country is very is very important for me because I love this sport. Yes. Yes. It gives me many things in my life. It changed me. Yes. Yeah, I won't, won't give back also. Yes. It will be a pleasure. I enjoy this moment with you. I give all my best. Excellent. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. McAlealy was welcomed by SKNFA President Atiba Harris, Prime Minister Dr. Terence Drew, and Sports Minister Samuel Duggins. And the SKNFA Technical Advisor, Mr. Claude McAlealy, former Real Madrid and Chelsea standout. No, he invented the Makalele role. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Welcome to Thank you. Sink It's Thank a Nevis. Thank you very much. Yes. Thank you. Consider him a guest of Sink It's a Nevis. Um, Makalele, I remember your days of playing. I did watch you play. A lot of people wanted to be like you. <laughs> and so I want to say that this initiative um, by the SKNFA to have you here in Sink It's a Nevis to be an advisor to our football development is indeed a momentous occasion. This is the type of innovation and forward thinking that we are looking for to develop sports. Sports can be an area or is an area that can really help to propel our country forward. And I want to thank you for heeding the call from SKNFA to, um, for coming to St. Kitts. Ever since you have taken office, you promised to transform football. And every step of the way, I can see those strides towards the goal. And I want to thank you for that. And I'm delighted as a Minister of Sports to be in this position while you are performing your deeds. Today marks another step in the right journey as we see this wonderful talent coming to bless our players with the knowledge, the insight, and the technical development that our country so desires. Because we do not lack talent. We never did. We lack the right training and expertise. And to have a legend on our shores, to impart his knowledge and experience, I think this is indeed a step in the right direction. The Sugar Boys will do battle with friends at Martin and Anguilla on March 23rd, followed by Aruba at the Warner Park on March 27th.